Hi and hello, welcome back. Jana here with a new process video for the HipKit Club. And today we are focusing on, or not focusing, but our topic is to use um, or to create a masculine or a Father's Day page without any pink. And so I'm scrapping a picture of my boy, of one of my boys, the middle one, in the age of, I don't know, two and a half maybe. And we were just out for a fun walk and he was looking for some big cars and there was this huge wheel and he just wanted to sit next to it. And uh, I really love that uh, snapshot. And so I'm scrapping that picture. And my idea was to create, oh no, wait, maybe we should also create our own striped background paper with some pattern papers. It could be, I am I may be wrong, but I think uh, something like that. So <laughs> I had a look through the papers and I grabbed um, some papers from Obit Marshall, I, Marshall, I, I believe, um, some Pink Fresh Studio papers, some... Oh my gosh, maybe Amy Tangerine or maybe some Jen Hatfield. I'm not sure right now, so I'm very sorry. But you can see I'm only grabbing blue tones and there's a bit of turquoise and light um, blue. And um, the very light papers is um, with a very soft yellow grid on it. And um, I really love how the papers are looking uh, next to each other, but I will skip the blue ones with the um, flowers on it. I would just go with six um, paper strips and I will now uh, find the perfect uh, perfect um, placement. And then I will uh, go ahead and stitch them down with my sewing machine. And then I will ruffle up and distress, distress the edges to get... Um, some fun texture on my background and this um, these are the papers I'm going with here you can see I stitched them, them down I ruffled up the edges I distressed them and I really love how this is looking I also let the um, thread ends on the paper and uh, now I'm looking through the um, exclusive pocket life cards to get some layering behind my picture I also have, or I already have, um, a few layers of tissue paper behind my picture. And now I'm uh, grabbing the blue um, pocket life card. I will distress the edges and then I will start to... No, first I will bring in some black splatters and I'm using um, just a kid's uh, watercolor set for that. I had that near or next to me on my desk and so I'm just going with that. And then I will start to create my uh, layout and my idea was to create a masculine page um, with flowers. So I'm only going with green and blue tones and I um, really uh, love to use florals for my masculine pages or even if I had used pink today, I'm totally fine with that because I don't like this, um, you know, pink is only for girls. It's not working here. I'm a mom of three boys and so I'm always scrapping um, the stuff I want. <clears throat> so now you can see I have my uh, black splatters on my paper. And now I'm uh, grabbing um, or I'm looking through the die cuts, the ephemera pieces and I will start with some Pink Fresh Studio stuff. Today was tough, embrace the mess and this is right now. But I will not use the um, banner shaped die cut. I will use the speech bubble with nope because I like it. And uh, then I will have a look into the Paige Evans um, flower uh, flowers yeah from the I believe that's Wonders collection um, but I think I will also grab some of the exclusive flowers from March I believe so I'm just um, looking through the stuff and then I will start to build up uh, my layout and I want to close everything um, I want to layer everything close around my picture and I will have everything on the left side from the paper um, and yeah, I really, I really love um, the colors. I love the blue, the blue, the blue. Sorry, that was a mix from German and English. So I really love the blue, um, different blue shades from the flowers. There's some uh, darker turquoise tones. There's some blue and some dark blue. And I really love how the colors are looking. And so I'm, now you can see, I'm just starting to build up my um, layout. 
I will also bring in lots of um, tangled thread underneath some of the flowers and I will go with, I, I believe I will go with um, blue and turquoise. And I just love to add um, thread to my projects. And um, it's also giving another texture and a fun look. And um, yeah, I just love it. So now you can see what my page will look like. And I totally love the cluster of the flowers with the green leaves tucked in. And uh, I tried to use this banner shaped um, die cut, but I will not use it. And um, I will go with other stuff instead. <clears throat> Excuse me. So now, um, yeah, there will uh, be the nope um, piece. And here you can see I glued everything down because of the um, ripped and, and distressed papers and um, the smooth surface from the die cuts. Everything was moving around and it was driving me crazy. And so I just took a little break. I glued everything down. I added my thread to the uh, flowers and I really love how this is looking. I stapled my two uh, paper pieces to the picture, the nope and the today was tough. And um, I just, I totally love how this is looking. And now I'm just trying to find some other bits and pieces from the um, make it I believe I believe these are the make it yeah um, but in the end I will not use uh, so much more I will add a little title or some words I will go with oh boy just because um, I wanted to move forward and he was like nope mom I want to stay here I love this big wheel and um, you need to stay with me and so it was like oh come on oh boy you know <laughs> um yeah, I'm trying to add some of these um, foam hearts, but um, I will not. So I believe now my title comes into the game and um, then I am done. So you will get um, some close-ups and some final pictures at the end. And I really hope you are inspired to create something beautiful today. Grab your kids, mix them, use them and have fun. And um, yeah, that's from me for today. Thank you so much for stopping by. I wish you all a great day. And um, yeah, talk to you soon. Bye.